this is Edward. You know this guy, Jake. Morning. He's back. Morning. About time you come back, dude. It's been a while. Pretty slow. Yeah, I know. I, I, I know you were. But hey, I'm glad you're back, dude. Me uh, too. Missed you in these videos. Uh, yeah, I missed on being in the videos. Hey, we're in the kitchen today, and I'm going to explain that in just a minute. It's not because I'm going to feed him or cook or anything like that, but thought just because of what's coming up, but this would be a great place here, Jake, that we could post this video in our kitchen today. Hey, if you don't know this already, I don't know how anybody could not know what's going on this weekend. Disciple Jake. now for the students 6th through 12th grade. Yeah, I, I'm telling you, if you don't know that, then you probably haven't watched our video in like two months and probably haven't been to church in two months. and. Uh, probably come to church. But anyway, uh, Disciple Now is coming this weekend. It's going to start Friday night. We're not doing host homes. That means kids will not be sleeping in homes together. They'll be sleeping in their own homes. And it's going to be all weekend long. It's uh, I've got another church down the road. Holly Brook is joining our student ministry. Or we're joining theirs, however that works we're out. We're coming together. And uh, just go, it's going to be a great weekend for students. And so I'm really excited about that this weekend. Uh, be praying for that. Uh, if you don't have a student in the ministry, uh, pray for them. Uh, if you want to help with that, uh, the cost is $60. And so if there's a kid that doesn't have the money, we're going to scholarship them as best we can. If you want to be a part of that, reach out to David, uh, or you can go online and uh, uh, do that there. So, uh, Jake, also you sent me a message yesterday, our cancer support, women face, facing uh, cancer. It has gone virtual uh, just for this season because women who are uh, fighting cancer, their immune system's already kind of lowered. Oh, nice. And so uh, they've decided to go online. So if you would still like to be a part of that, we can connect you with Sherry Sims. Uh, and that way you can be a part of that. So make sure uh, you get the word out about that. And then once once it kind of clears out, they'll start doing yeah. that uh, more. So you want to talk about what's going on next Wednesday? Uh, next Wednesday, we've got our Kid Venture kids that start their Wednesday night program back up. So uh, it'll be kindergarten through second grade. It'll be the first Wednesday. And then they'll rotate. The older kids will be the following Wednesday. But this next coming Wednesday, I'll start with K through second. And then Sunday, the fourth Sunday of the month, which is the 23rd, we'll have our first membership of the year. So if you want to be a part of membership class, make sure you put that on one of the communication cards or reach out to the church office. And that's going to be a big day too that morning. Uh, we've got a guest speaker coming in that yep. morning. And I'm telling you, you do not want to miss that Sunday. A famous uh, guest speaker. Uh, blogger. He uh, writes, been on staff at some really cool places. It's going to be here, and uh, we are so excited. Which brings us to the reason why we're in the kitchen, Jake. Small groups. Small groups. January 30th, we're going to be starting a new round of small groups. I think I'm just going to get something out of your fridge. I'm you know, kind of hungry today. see, that's the beauty of small groups. That when you get in community and you begin to hang out with people, you have refrigerator rice. And uh, Jake has refrigerator rice. How old is this pizza? Uh, a couple of days. All right, sweet. You want to have a piece? Yeah. That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. So that's the beauty of small groups. You have these relationships to where um, we would love to say that you spend that time in groups and you become refrigerator rights at your house. So uh, Jake and I have been working together 17 years nearly. And uh, we have refrigerator rights at our, at our house. And so each other, he usually comes in, checks my fridge, I check his. But anyway, January 30th, if you're not in a small group, we want to invite you to get into a small group. It's going to be awesome. We're going to be launching a new rounds. Our existing groups are going to continue to meet, and we're really excited about that. And it's going to, we're going to talk about that. It's going to be on January 30th. January the 30th. And then I found out just before I took the stage Sunday morning, and I was going to mention it, but I got totally distracted because I was ready to get in the Word. Uh, our Love One ministry on the weekends that distributes food. Uh, we do this all week long in meal boxes and uh, uh, meet needs in the community. But on Friday and Saturday, we actually have other ministries come to our church. Last Friday, Jake, or Saturday, I can't remember which day it was, 8,000 eggs. 8,000. 8,000. That's a bunch of eggs. They were able to give away and, and minister to this community. And so I want to say thank you to Love One and those guys that volunteer on Friday and Saturday. You're making a difference. Summit Heights, you're making a difference. And, dude, that's really cool right there. This pizza's making a difference. Uh, is it? Mm -hmm. That's called refrigerator rights, man. Mm -hmm. Summit, we sure love you. You got anything else while you're uh, mouthful? Getting a haircut at 1 o'clock. You need a haircut. You look kind of shaggy. We love you. Can't wait to see you Sunday. 
10, uh, 10 o'clock, uh, Disciple Night Weekend. It's going to be celebrating uh, all that God does this weekend on Sunday morning at 10 o'clock. We love you. Share this on all your platforms. We'll see you Sunday.